everyone and welcome to this very exciting summer haul 2020 creating a capsule wardrobe with jigsaw fashion i have been shopping at jigsaw from the age of about 18 so i feel like a bit of a kid in the candy store right now so let me have a look about i'll try some pieces on and see what you all think So I spotted this straight away when I came in the door. Absolutely love this dress. I love the color, I love the stripes. I think that is beautiful for summer. So definitely going to get them. Well actually, they do it as a shirt as well. So I think I need to try that one too. I've been a big fan of Jigsaw's uh, linen t-shirts. That's probably how I first came across Jigsaw actually, was at 19 years old coming in, getting a brilliant linen t-shirt and buying them ever since and then kind of gravitated towards the dresses and the silk options. So I definitely want to find myself one of those. And I know it's not quite the season, but I really do love that as well. I can try it on. I'm prepared for autumn winter there. Mm, the jacket. That feels beautiful. I'm guessing that's a Napa leather. Yeah. I must say as well, I've come into the store while it's closed. So we're here very early. They've opened especially so we can film this episode. So otherwise, of course, I would have a mask on. And everything I touch is going to be steamed afterwards. So we're being super safe. Oh, there's a nice linen option. I might have to do two runs around the store because I've got my arms full. So let me head to the changing room and see what these look like. Okay, so first up is this beautiful dress that I'm wearing. Now, this is made from a blend of linen and cotton. So it feels really lovely and lightweight and airy against your body, particularly for summer. But I also really see this dress as something that could be a great transitional piece that you could take through to autumn, winter as well. I would certainly style this in winter with a pair of tights and maybe layer a top underneath. I think it would really, really work. So I don't know if you can see in these images here, but it's got a really fine check detail running through it. Obviously a deep navy color, but the check is very finely running through with that lovely white stripe, but it's a really subtle one. It's not too in your face. It feels really elegant and timeless, which is what we love. So I have styled it, first of all, just adding a leather belt to it. So you feel like you're giving yourself a little bit more shape at the waist here. And then all I've done is lift the fabric back over the top again. And I think that's a really nice look in itself. But I've also shown you in these images how I would wear it loose. And that's definitely a way I would style it, particularly when it's really hot and I just need it light and airy. So a really beautiful, beautiful dress to start with. Hopefully you agree. I think this one is definitely a winner. Now, though I'm not hugely keen on leather trousers, I definitely love leather jackets, and I found myself this beautiful one in store. I can't tell you how soft it feels. It's absolutely gorgeous. Now, it's been made from Napa leather, which is often thought of as the most luxurious and very soft and buttery feeling leather, and it retails at 298. So, not cheap, cheap, but in theory, you only have to buy one in your lifetime, and it should last you forever. So, a good investment piece. I would say. So it's very much a classic biker jacket done in that beautiful soft leather. You've got all the usual zips, which you can do up if you wanted to, but personally, from a styling point of view, I don't think I ever wear my leather jackets done up. I just leave them open. A nice detail is the zip up the arm here, which you can undo, so then you can shimmy them up your arms a little bit, which is quite nice if it's sort of a moderately warm day like it is today. I like the fact that it's sitting just on my hip bone, so it's going to cover any the unsightly bumps which I don't want to show it's just that perfect length to be able to feel like you've got a crop jacket on so I've gone for a UK 10 which is my usual size and I would say the fit is perfect so very true to size do remember of course with any leather it is going to stretch a bit so it will get a bit more slouchy but in my humble opinion it just gets better with age so for this look I have styled it with a beautiful linen shirt because Jigsaw of course are very famous for their beautiful linens I think that works nice under it and a pair of their straight jeans in the dark indigo wash and I've popped my own heels with it actually just to show you how you could dress up such a very simple outfit for the evening I'm literally wearing a pair of jeans and a linen shirt but sticking a leather jacket over the top with a nice pair of heels maybe a nice handbag 
feels really elevated and polished without having to try very hard at all. So next up, I've put together a very casual, everyday chic kind of outfit. The sort of thing I would wear on a day-to-day -day basis throughout summer. So aside from that gorgeous color, I love the shape of that really boxy fit. I would advise sizing down if you like it too, because going true to size felt a little bit big, whereas this still feels oversized, but it doesn't feel too over the top. Now, obviously you've just got a simple collar here, but the nice thing is you haven't got any seam across the sleeves here. So that lovely shape to just drape down with those sleeves. And then they've got a little turn up on the end as well. So I've paired it with Jigsaw's classic Chino trousers, which retail at 85 pounds. Now these are available in lots and lots of different colors, some really beautiful tones actually. So I will pop a link in the description where you can see all of those. But I tried them on in the shade they call bamboo because I wanted that really natural summery vibe, particularly to go with a shirt like this. I think the contrast is really nice together. And then I've just added a belt which is of a similar tone to the shoes and then that gorgeous straw bag and a pair of sunnies to finish. So a really polished and chic outfit to wear every day throughout summer, made from beautiful fabrics that all really blend and contrast nicely together. So next up, I've gone for a workwear look, which hopefully you guys will love as much as I do. I don't get the chance to wear suits very often, so it actually feels quite a novelty for me. But Jigsaw are really well known for their beautiful quality workwear, so absolutely worth having a look. So I decided to go for the Paris suit because I thought it was very smart and elevated, but felt really modern at the same time. And the really nice thing about this suit is that you could use these pieces as individuals as well. I could easily style this blazer with a pair of jeans, for more classic day wear. And the same with the trousers as well. They've got a really lovely slim fit. And I'll show you in this footage as well how they look really lovely without the blazer, just as a nice everyday casual outfit. So I've gone true to size in both the blazer and the trousers, and I would say they're a perfect fit. They're quite slim line, but in a really nice way. For someone who loves oversized clothing, it's quite nice for a change to be wearing something quite slim line. It feels really beautiful on. You've got that pleat detail down the front and then just a bit of a cut out at the ankle, which looks really nice with those trainers I've paired it with on my feet. These are new in actually, made from 100% leather and they're 110 pounds. I absolutely love them. So although I don't really have anywhere to wear a suit, I really would quite like it. So quite a different outfit for me, but definitely the sort of thing I would choose if I worked in an office. But certainly the blazer and the trousers as separates could absolutely work really nicely, mixing and matching with all the pieces I've got in my capsule wardrobe. So then I went for this very beautiful feminine elegant dress. I absolutely love this. I love it even more on actually than I did on the hanger. I think it's a really pretty shade of blue that especially hopefully as I get a bit of a tan will look even nicer. So you have got that white stripe running through it and then you've just got these little embroidery details. You've got these beautiful little puff sleeves with just the cuff on the hem there. That's fitting really nicely actually. It's not too tight whatsoever going true to size. Then you've got the drawstring at the waistband of so you can really cinch that in at the waist. And then you've got that gorgeous skirt portion, which is actually quite wide in fabric, but between the waist being able to pull it in and that lovely drop hem at the seam, it's giving you a beautiful drape as you walk. This is the sort of thing I would wear day in, day out throughout spring, summer. It feels beautiful, very pretty and elegant. I don't think it would ever date. I could imagine having this in my wardrobe in 10 years time and still loving it just as much. And certainly something I know I would get a lot of wear out of. Now this beautiful blue and white striped fabric with the embroidery details is also available as a shirt as well, which is something that I picked up. So if the dress isn't quite you and it feels too much, you could always just opt for the shirt, which I think would look lovely with just a pair of jeans or a nice pair of chinos that would be another option too. Now, it's not often I find a skirt that I like, so when I do, it's definitely worth shouting about. I think it's all about the length for me, to find one that's comfortable to wear, but also flattering at the same time. So this one has been made from 100% linen. Um, it's not too heavy, but it's not too light either, and it's been lined as well, so there's no danger of it being too see-through. Now, what I really love about it is the fit across the waistband and the hip area. I think that is skimming in all the right places, and then the shape just scoops 
reached out nicely from your hip section. So it feels like it's really flattering is what I'm trying to say. So at the waistband here, you've got the belt hooks and then obviously the ties so you can cinch it in a little bit more. So the hem is actually quite circular. So it's giving it a really nice movement as you walk, which just kind of adds to the appeal of it for me as well. Now, as there's quite a lot of detail going on with the skirt, I just wanted to pair it with something very simple, like a classic white t-shirt. Jigsaw actually do really nice t-shirts, definitely up there with my favorite white tees. You could maybe add a necklace over the t-shirt, but I don't think you wanna to get too fussy with too many different elements, as I think it's quite nice and simple on its own. I really hope you enjoyed this edition taking a closer look at Jigsaw's collection. I personally think it's a beautiful, beautiful range of clothes, really high quality, and everything I've ever bought in the past has lasted so well. So hopefully you like it as much as me. It'd be really interesting to hear all your different opinions in the comments section below. So do let me know which was your favorite piece I tried on today. And as always, thank you so much for your support, for all your likes, subscribes, and comments. It's very much appreciated. <laughs>